In this video, we'll take a look at whether copper 2 chloride is ionic or covalent. That's CuCl2. And the short answer is that CuCl2 is an ionic compound. If we look at the periodic table, we find copper right here. And that's a metal. So we have a metal with copper and chlorine over here. That's a nonmetal. So when we have a metal bonded to a nonmetal, almost always we end up with an ionic bond. So in the case of copper 2 chloride, according to the periodic table, it's ionic. Since it's ionic, we really should look at the charge on the ions. So for copper, it's a transition metal, so we can't figure its charge out just by looking at it here on the periodic table. But chlorine, that's in group 17, sometimes called 7A, and all of these have a 1 minus ionic charge. So since we have two of them, 2 times 1 minus, we have a 2 minus here, copper has to be a 2 plus, and that's why we call it copper 2, because it has a 2 plus ionic charge. So we have our positive copper ion and our negative chloride ion. We actually have two chloride ions. Positive and negative attract, we end up with an ionic bond. This is Dr. B answering the question whether copper 2 chloride, CuCl2, is ionic or covalent. It is ionic. Thanks for watching.